This past homecoming week has been one for the record books. From girls powder puff, to the boys dance team, to the actual dance itself. Senior Caitlin Sturgis and junior Tasha Erin Nichols share what their thoughts are about the powder puff game. During powder puff this year, it was just a great adrenaline rush and I just put 100% effort into it. I went all out, all having fun at the same time. And it, I have to thank the coaches, especially like Tanner and Gio, because they just pushed us to be our best. And yeah, it was a lot of fun. Our club was really, really fun. The girls really had a nice time. We worked really hard. We were dedicated. We put our blood, sweat, and tears into it. And we really beat the seniors pretty bad. Juniors Michael Wright and Savannah Eccles, and seniors Alex Roll and Emily White share their initial reactions to being announced as royalty at the homecoming dance. Whenever I was voted uh, homecoming prince, I felt pretty honored and happy. But at the same time, I really wasn't that worried about it if I won or lost. It was more of just an experience thing. When I won homecoming princess, I was really surprised and it was really exciting. Um, I wasn't expecting that, so it was really cool to be nominated and then win. So I was more like excited for Alex than anything, and so I wasn't really thinking of the moment at the time. So um, when they announced me, I was just kind of like, that just happened. Uh, it was kind of crazy. It was really exciting though, um, especially since me and Alex are such good friends. So it was cool to share that experience with someone. Um, when they announced me as homecoming king, um, obviously it felt awesome. It was really cool to be there, but um, they announced me first and then the queen second. So it was like, I really wanted both of us to win. Um, it was kind of a thing where we were both in it together the whole time and I wouldn't have been as happy if I won myself. So I was glad when I won, but I was even more happy whenever uh, she won too. For TJ Brown, Mason Goffey, and Avery Hobson, I'm Andrew Clark for Cutlass TV News.